This video will show you how to use the Torch Vision Center Crop Transform to do a rectangular crop of a pill image. First, we import PyTorch. Then, we check the PyTorch version we are using. We are using PyTorch 0.4.0. .0. Next, we import Torch Vision. Then, we check the Torch Vision version we are using. We are using Torch Vision version 0.2.1. Then, from the Python Imaging Library, pill, we import image. The image that we're going to be using for this video example is the official Navy portrait photograph for Commodore Grace M. Hopper. This can be found on GitHub in the following repository. Here we see github.com slash sebg slash AI workbox dash data. When you click on here, you'll see that I go into the images folder and then the Grace underscore M underscore Hopper folder. When I scroll down, you'll see that there's a readme and then there's the image that we're going to be using, which is 517 pixels by 606 pixels. Having saved it down into our local directory, let's load it into our Python environment using pills image.open. So here you can see the grace hopper image that we just referenced, and we're going to assign this to the Python variable grace hopper image. Now that it's been loaded into our environment, let's take a look at the image using pills.show operation. Let me resize it for us. And there is Commodore Hopper. Now that we have the photograph, we're going to use PyTorch Torch Vision Center Crop Transform to do a rectangular crop of this pill image. The first thing we do is we define the Torch Vision Center Crop Transform. So here we see torchvision.transforms.centercrop, and we're going to pass in two numbers, 300 comma 50. Note that there is a parenthesis to start and a parenthesis to end. So we're passing in a list of two numbers to the center crop operation. And then all of this is going to be assigned to the Python variable PT center crop transform rectangle. Let's check the transform to see what it gives us. And we see that it is a center crop and the size is going to be 300 by 50. The first number specifies the height. So it's going to be 300 pixels high. And the second number specifies the width. So it's going to be 50 pixels wide. So center crop is going to return to us an image that is crop that is 300 pixels high by 50 pixels wide. Let's now apply this to our original Commodore Grace Hopper image. So we have the Python variable PT center crop transform rectangle, and we're going to pass in our Grace Hopper image to it, and we're going to assign what this returns to the Python variable center crop underscore rectangle. If we just evaluate the center crop underscore rectangle Python variable, we can see that it's a pill image. We see that the mode is RGB. We see that the size is 50 by 300, and it's at some address. The interesting thing here is that the numbers have been reversed. So when we initially define our center crop, it's height and then width. With the pill image, it's width and then height. Finally, let's use the pill show operation on our center crop rectangle to actually view the image that was created. And there we have it, a rectangular image that is 300 pixels high by 50 pixels wide. If we go back to the original image and we say here is the center, we're going 300 pixels high and 50 pixels wide, which is why we see this. Perfect. We were able to use the Torch Vision Center Crop Transform to do a rectangular crop of a pill image using the height and width that we wanted to specify.